What's up guys, it's Dylan J Math with another vlog. And with VidCon coming up, some of you might be wondering if I'm going to be there. Uh, most likely you notice that I haven't been talking about it if you follow me on my social media or just on this channel. Cause normally I'd be tweeting something like, oh, I'm going to VidCon or posting a video about VidCon. But this year, I'm just not going. And also for the foreseeable future, I will not be going. But that stands to change from year to year. One of the reasons I'm not going is financial reasons. Um, I would rather spend my money on a week beach vacation, which could actually cost less than going to VidCon for three days. Cause I haven't had a proper beach vacation in five years. And uh, I think I wanna do that this year. So I made the decision quite a few months ago that I wasn't even gonna try going to VidCon. And the next reason is that it seems like a big waste of time if you're not a bigger creator or at least someone who's like big enough that people actually care about your stuff. I mean, sure, you get to meet some of your favorite creators, but with the security and all of that, it just seems like you'll never actually get to meet them personally unless they decide to roam the halls themselves. Now, I'm not saying don't go to VidCon because it's still a great convention to socialize with your fellow smaller creators, but honestly, in my experience, it was kind of a waste of time, but uh, it, it, that's all up to you. And the last reason I'm not going is because VidCon seems to be filling with narcissistic people and annoying little kids. Now, not all of you guys are annoying kids. Just, just, just calm down, okay? I'm just talking about like the fucking Jake Paul fans, Logan Paul fans. And there's also a crossover between the narcissistic people and the annoying little kids because of Jake Paul and Logan Paul's narcissistic attitudes. It's influencing the kids. There are other creators who are gonna be there that are narcissistic assholes that have annoying fans too. Seeing those douchey fucking teenagers or like young adults with like their fucking hoverboards like vlogging 24 seven, not actually stopping to experience anything because they actually don't care about anything beside themselves. But I digress. Those are the reasons why I'm not going to VidCon this year and any time in the foreseeable future, but like I said, subject to change year by year. So that's the explanation as to why you might not see me there if you're one of the people that I might actually, if you're also one of the people that go to VidCon. I know one of my subscribers, uh, Teresa, she's, she goes, she, we met last year. So if you see this, yeah, I'm not gonna be there. Um, But VidCon is still a great convention. Uh, just VidCon is still a VidCon is still a good convention. Just be mindful of that stuff that I said. So remember to like the video, subscribe if you're new here, and comment down below if you're going to VidCon or if you're not. What are your reasons for not going? And I will see you guys next time.